Hello YouTube, welcome back to Force Restart where we make tech simple for you. In today's video, we're going to show you how to factory reset or erase your iPhone and completely remove all of your data, photos, videos, apps, any personal information you had, everything that you ever put on your iPhone since you set it up, this method will delete that locally on your iPhone, but if you have iCloud, account it will just save it there if you are backing it up there so let's show you guys how to do this now before we proceed to doing a factory reset or erasing your iphone 13 here first thing to do is before going anywhere is simply backing up your data because once you do this and if you haven't backed up your data it will not be recoverable in any way and would make it impossible to pretty much recover that data so what do we mean by doing that well there's a couple ways to back it up if you're using iCloud account you can back it up there but there's if you're using the free iCloud account it's only five gigs so some stuff might not get backed up the best probably way to back it up is using iTunes on your PC or your computer that you have you can back it up there or if you have a new phone simply transfer everything over verify that everything has transferred over and that you are comfortable resetting your phone that you're about to completely delete everything off from it so let's show you how to do that so when you're ready to do that and you are comfortable that you backed up your data now let's go ahead and do the resetting so you're gonna simply go over to settings now once you go over settings one quick thing usually that helps is if you're already signed in here go ahead and click on there and then sign out at the bottom you'll see option to sign out that's gonna be one thing now if you don't do it this way when you go to uh, go to fat erase it which is going to be in general here and then all the way at the bottom you notice the option where it says transfer or reset iPhone you want to click on that now once you click on that you're going to be given this menu option where you have the option to erase all content and setting now this is the option that you need to erase your iPhone as you can see here this gives a quick message about erasing and how much in how much of uh, the apps and data it will erase. So as you can see here on this phone, there's about 15.5 gig that will be erased and completely removed from it. So you want to hit continue here. And once we hit continue, we get a final message sort of warning us that once we do this again, all media data and setting will be erased and this cannot be undone. That's why, as we mentioned, multiple times in the beginning of the video is that you are backed up somewhere whether it's a new phone on your iTunes through your computer or simply just on using iCloud backup that also works so once you're comfortable here you're gonna hit that erase button and once you hit that erase button it's gonna kick off the process and now the process can take somewhere between a minute or two to sometimes even several minutes five minutes sometimes even ten minutes again it's gonna solely depend on how much information it has to erase so if you had tons of video maybe tons of apps that needs to be deleted it's gonna take much longer compared to someone that doesn't have too much on their phone it's gonna be quicker that's why it's gonna be really dependent on sort of the stuff that you had on your iPhone now you'll see a couple times the Apple logo appearing here it's simply just doing the process and once it has done all of that it's gonna be simply giving us back to the main screen where initially you you, you got when you were setting up your iPhone with the languages the Wi-Fi connection and all that stuff now if you're selling your phone or giving it away trading it in another thing to do is simply go ahead and take the sim card out here it's a it's gonna be right here as you can see here this sim card is attached to your phone number so if you're moving that over you probably moved it over to a new phone or simply if you got a new sim card you can discard the old one and use the new one on your new sim card but something to consider of doing of course it's not necessary but it's something probably want to consider doing as part of the reset of it and as you can see this phone did had about 15 gigs or so to erase and it took as you can see at the end of this video we're at at the main screen on iOS 15 that animation comes up and at the home screen now this phone is ready to be traded in 
giveaway or sold whatever you prefer and all of your information has been erased so hopefully this video was helpful if this video is helpful please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching see you guys next time